Hello and welcome to my channel. Oh, it's cold this morning. Um, so, in this video, I'd like to talk about logic and how uh, my experiences of using logic and audacity throughout my time of learning about the likes of sound design and sound in theatre in general. And logic, I found to be quite complex and to get what your your desired sound quickly say if you've missed the likes of a rehearsal process and you're going into tech and when you when you're going into tech you need sounds to be edited quickly you know and fast and I find myself scrolling through the likes of logic menus so Logic, like I'm just scrolling through the like the menus and like I'm clicking EQs and compressors and having to do all this stuff just to try to basically what I'm trying to say is like to get the end result quickly. So in the tech, there's not much time for like processing and faffing and tinkering within log within like a program like Logic. Not just partic not in particular Logic, but like a program such as Logic. So you are tinkering and maybe it's great logic for the likes of a soundscape but for the likes of audacity it's great because it's free and it's accessible to everyone on windows or mac and i find it to be a great tool for getting the likes of your sound or effects or soundscape quickly and effectively Whereas Logic, I find myself like going in and having to like tinker with things and you're looking for buttons and you're constantly like, I need to get the sound, like not immediately, but almost like immediately. So I need the time, the time that it takes me to get to my end result is a lot, I found a lot smoother and a lot quicker and a lot more effective than the likes of Audacity. Whereas Logic is great for like the rehearsal process where you like tinker in. Um, I mean, I'm sure you could use Logic on the fly, but Audacity, I found you can just like slide up and down the amplification just like this. And you just literally slide in up and down really easily. And you click preview, you get the sound straight away. And then you click OK. And then you literally, it's just a case of exporting it from there. You select the audio that you want. And you can just like, select that snippet and then select audio that I'd like to export out of Audacity and then there you go straight away you've got the sound effect that maybe it needs tinkering with later but you can just go back into Audacity really quickly and make a few minor adjustments whereas Logic I find myself almost almost lost not, not lost but like lost within but like an interface which isn't like really quick and intuitive just to click up to the effects rack and then go amplification click preview and click ok and then export out of audacity within a matter of minutes